Cancer, welcome to your October readings. As always, keep in mind that this is only a general reading. Always take what it feels right and with what does resonate within your own life experiences at this time. If you would like a personal reading with me, please contact me through the email I put in the description box below. I have been thinking upon doing a special sales price uh, reading uh, each month in accordance to what I feel and believe it's the theme of each month. So because we are in Libra season and we are celebrating this beautiful new moon on the sign of scales, uh, for the month of October, I'll be doing a special relationship dynamic uh, focus. So if you have uh, any type of uh, insight you would like to receive on a specific relationship of any sorts in your life, please contact me. I'll be glad to connect with you and share all the information and details that are necessary for this promotion. Now, Cancer. I feel that uh, in October, some of you are quite fearful of the direction your life is going. Some of you are afraid that this direction is too much on too much um, on the element of you not knowing everything. So you are kind of walking on the shadows here towards where you are going. It's like there's a blindfold. You know that you feel the movement, you feel the pressure, you feel that the changes are being put in motion and placed, but I feel that some of you are battling with the sense of not knowing what's going to come after it or what's going to come out of it so i feel that for some of you to begin with you are not sure that the direction you and your family probably are going because i do feel that there's some cancers that are dealing with changes uh in regards not only to themselves but their families or relationships that suddenly for some reason there's changes of direction here either actual actual physical changes of place uh home uh location or changes in the direction that a, rela a relationship was taking and suddenly it took uh a complete different route so first of all that's the the biggest highlight here is that you are afraid of the direction this um, your life is going at this time, particularly for those who who had to suddenly change the course of something in their lives in regards to plans, projects, finances, ad adaptations to financial situations that uh, needed some um, needed some attention. So I feel that some cancers are dealing with a lot, a lack of optimism. There's a lot of negative focus. That's the challenge is to overcome your negativity and the focus on the lack. But you are also uh, lacking a sense of adventure so that you could go into this new venture and this new opportunities and this change in a more with with the more uh you know with your heart open with no expectations to what will come but knowing that what will come for sure for sure it will be better than the circumstance that forced the change to happen because i feel that some cancers have been dealing with um some type of um you know some type of bad human behavior around them or through them because we are all human and we all fall sometimes into behaviors of the shadow where we are confronted with our own issues so i feel that there has been an energies of lies manipulation uh maybe blackmail or or corruption um addictions things that were not allowing this freedom of your essence to come forward in what you were trying to do others of you are were simply dealing with uh, a lack of um 
I feel that some of you were trying to look at the future in ways that would allow maybe uh, much more of the dreams of others than your own to be on 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 to be on the lead of the boat and suddenly things changes and there was this all this need for you to adapt to new circumstances because I feel that you have forgotten yourself in the process somewhere either because of family issues financial burdens or you know relationship situations that really put you in a place of negativity and so now in October there's a turning point here that it's possible uh, probably more to the to the end of the month where you can feel more free more available more uh, connected with your inner rebel with your spirit of adventure you this element of optimism and you know um, a lifting the, a putting down your walls I feel that some cancers have their walls really really high and you have been either trying some of you have been trying to push people aside how some of you have been pushing uh, people aside in a very cold uh, manner in reality you are just scared I feel that some cancers are in the majority of them they are scared they are afraid of the future they are afraid of what's going to come out out of something that happened that didn't brought a lot of happiness in, in, in the immediate way because I feel that some cancers are only looking to the bad are only looking to the situation um, that's in front of them and not of the possibility of the available room that will exist because of the circumstance and I know when we are dealing with challenges it's not easy of course to have this um, to have this perception but whichever new direction you are going you and your family you and your dreams you and your ambitions is one that is better it's one that it's going to allow um, a real new direction I feel that some of you some cancers are going to change uh, career paths uh, dramatically some cancers are going to change the way they go uh, upon money fi uh, finances budgeting purchases um, their nutrition their daily routines some cancers are going to change practical affairs of life dramatically really it, but it's a change that I it feels that um, allows more room for this and innovation you know there's an element of cancer that I feel is growing here from being more on a traditional pattern of life more conventional pattern of life more expected pattern of life and suddenly you are asked to be different be bold do things on uh, in an outside of the box way eccentric way unique way and you know I feel that also for some cancers this is a lesson of uh, adaptation to things that we cannot control and that we will never be able to control which is things that are outside of our of our grasp and so we can always rebuild we can always change our focus we can always try to uh, to uh, empower not disempower our our um, ourselves and who we are because I feel that some cancers also need to I feel that some cancers need to go back to their go back to basics go back to uh, their original original plans back back then I feel that some cancers have good chances of rescuing something from a past um, past period of your life that something that you didn't followed or you didn't pursue because you felt you didn't have the skills or you didn't have the knowledge you dismissed the knowledge or you didn't have the actual tools at that time but right now you can you can regain them and you can start a, a clean slate cancers will start a clean slate soon and I feel this is very related with um, 
the path of life and the way you live your life actually in a very day-to-day -day basics doing things in a much more carefree way uh, some of you could be uh, going through this because of uh, family conditioning so needing to step out of family expectations of who you should be and how your life should be and what your job should be and what type of income you should receive you know some of you could be dealing with this as well uh, but if you if you take the blindfold off you will see that the path forward is full of possibilities the six of swords is in your subconscious in the unknown so there's definitely a positive a positive change coming here a positive direction that you are walking into that you are going into unexpectedly probably that even though maybe what led you to go into this boat to go somewhere was not good or didn't feel good but once you land in whichever place you do you will find that there's much more to be grateful for and happy for the full clean slate new beginnings new potential uh being uh being yourself being free of burdens being free of expectations being free of um conventions and responsibilities that do not make sense to your life anymore or that are not part of the beliefs you have created so far so adaptation between what you believe you are entitled and the type of life you live i also feel that are very important here so you have the three of wands and you have the devil as the main focus and challenge so the three of wands and the devil one wants you to be this beautiful free spirited being carefree childish adventurous looking to the future with hope with optimism with laughter you know being silly being gullible being a little bit shallow but because you know when we are lifted up from burdens when we are in this optimistic vibration we don't need to be that deep always we don't need to be that serious we don't need to be that um harsh sometimes we can simply be a child sometimes you can simply be uh feeling good and taking that laughter in whichever place we go the devil on the other hand it's very much more negative focus card and it's one that is more pessimistic more harsh more um repressed because he wants to enslave you and this is enslavement of your own inner fears inner insecurities uh things that you feel you are bound to or enslaved by or obliged to dependencies addictions uh insecurities obsessions i also feel that some of you may be obsessing with things that um you don't accept or you're having a difficulty accept that are not a part or not to be a part of your life and so the five of pentacles here in your conscious position creates this very keen awareness that you don't have all that you want you feel the lack you feel unsupported or you feel that life is not being fair or life is not giving you the opportunities you deserve because maybe you have been looking for them some of you have been looking for them where where uh in a place that they were unable to be there for you or some of you are going through this process of understanding your own needs and actually realizing that maybe you are the one putting yourself more on the outside of life the outcast not being able to connect because of the fear the fear of being judged the fear of being different the fear of criticism so you put yourself in your walls and you hide in your castle with walls of ice so no one can reach you 
I feel some cancers are really dealing with issues of um, hurting themselves by hurting themselves by believing they are protecting themselves so be careful some cancers need to be careful with negative focus on everything because this negative focus is the only thing not allowing you to see the bright beautiful joyful new direction october is pushing you to go towards adventures projects ambition international affair communication joining forces with friends to build something or uh, ideas that come together for success taking a break travel new direction healing detaching from drama detaching from unnecessary um burdens and expectations and being free it's the outcome so in october you have a chance to reach freedom real freedom from within if you allow yourself to take the blindfold off and watch where you are not allowing life to come in others to come in love to come in opportunities to come in so i feel that in reality some cancers are not allowing opportunities to come in and at the same time feeling bad because there's nothing happening because they're not allowing see i feel that some cancers have a very strong wall protecting them or what that they want to use to protect them from the outside but by doing so you are also preventing good energies of freedom release opportunity success love intimacy to come to you and i think that in october you will realize um you, you will realize this with a lot of importance and actually it's funny for all signs right now in majority i only have more three more to do this five of pentacles energy and this feeling of uh negative focus and neg uh, focus on the lack it has been prominent to almost all signs so use your brightness to light up your world and to light the world of others you have more light more fun you are more funny more joyful more uh, inspiring than what you are giving yourself credit for so I hope I was able to provide some insight thank you so much for all of you who have been liking sharing sharing commenting I really 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 appreciate it and please keep uh, continue continuing to, to do so and hopefully we'll see each other soon